So I just realized in the last video I never actually showed the seats that I promised I was going to show. Which is what the video is titled, so um, here they are. I don't know how I forgot to do that. See, you remember the before. Got the black leather with the red stitching. Look at that in the back seat. Look at that. What's up everybody? Headed into the office. As you can see I'm a little dressed up today. We've got big things going on. Not really, we've got a meeting today downtown. That's pretty important, so gotta put on the big boy clothes. So some people might be wondering why is Matt throwing up videos of himself and his family? Well, let me explain. I'm not really sure what I'm doing, but it's fun. So I'm gonna keep doing it. There's a term used, it's called vlogging, which is like a blog, but on video. So it's really not that easy to do. I'm literally talking to a camera all day long or periodically throughout the day and, and trying to get some cool stuff um, which is pretty awkward at times making videos of basically just my everyday life which at times isn't all, all that awesome um, but it's my life so it's awesome to me and you know get to meet my family and, and just hang out with us really and obviously I appreciate all the support of anybody that watches or subscribes to our channel life's not supposed to be just boring same thing every day you got to make it exciting you got to do got to do things that make you nervous things that scare you this starting out has kind of definitely been one of them so challenging myself and challenging my family really to take part in this with me and have some fun so I guess that's my message for today if you have something you've always wanted to do but it kind of scares you go ahead and do it anyways you'll be amazed at how good it makes you feel or how how much happier you'll be you at least gotta try it once right but that's what we're doing if you're wondering why you keep seeing videos pop up on my Facebook or the Instagram or anything like that saying hey come watch our video that's what it is I'm not sharing anything else it's literally videos of our life so hope you watch hope you enjoy so this is what it's like walking into my house at the end of the day here he comes They locked me out. What's up, buddy? What are you doing? The greeter of the Crawford House. <laughs> the greeter of the Crawford House. Dad, Dad, Mom's so boring. She doesn't do anything all day. Nothing. Hey, don't bite my clothes. Hey baby girl, what are you doing? Oh no. What's this happening? She's like, Dad, I'm not camera ready. I'm not ready to be on camera. See, I, I come home and Nibbles is just ready in play mode. Ready to go. Ready to go. There's no cool down period for Dad. Nope. Dad, you're home. Time to play. Right. Right. Okay. For anyone who knows me, I'm pretty OCD on where things go and being neat and tidy and stuff. So when I get home, I gotta put my stuff away. Shoes. Shoes just go there. Keys. That's a good place for the keys. It and the wallet goes there. See, and then you got the clothes that I was wearing. You know, these, 
We got a special place for those. Those come in, they just go right back on the shelf. Because they're good for, what, like a whole other day or two? Nibbles, I gotta find Mom. I gotta find Mom. I'll come back. I'll come back. Where's Mama? Nibbles, I, I'm gonna come back. What's Mama doing? What are you doing, baby girl? Hey, Daddy, I'm smiling. Nibbles. Really? <laughs> Sit. Paul. Good boy. Good boy. Down. Down. You ready for the best one? Roll over. Okay. Hey, sit. Hugs. Good boy. Good boy. Okay, hey, enough. Enough. Nibbles, enough. Good boy. Good. Run, boy, run. I always enjoy this part of the day because I'm home. I always love walking through that front door, getting attacked by this little guy, and uh, seeing my wife, seeing the kids, and just you know you can relax. Take a shower, get in your comfortable clothes, and it's time to relax. I mean, I still have work to do, but I get to be in my own little element and relax with the family. I can make me a bowl of popcorn, maybe a soda. I love popcorn. Lately, you ever have those things that you go through these like phases where you can't get enough of it? Like stuff that you've had all along and you never really eat or enjoy as much as you do for those small periods of time. Lately for me, it's been like soda. I've, I went 10 years without drinking soda. I stayed away from it, I never wanted it. It was unhealthy, the sugar, you know, everything. I was super healthy. And for some reason, all of a sudden, and it was right around when Kim got pregnant with Kinsley, that all of a sudden I just craved soda all the time. And I like, come home and have a soda or even two or three sometimes. And it's really bad for you, but I can't stop doing it. I've tapered off a little bit. I'm not doing as much as I used to, but definitely still drinking it pretty regularly. So I don't know. Let us know if any of y'all have any of that or what it's with because I think it's so weird how you have these things and then all of a sudden, you know, you want it. You never did before, but now you do. Ready? Ready, bud? Good boy! Yeah. He likes popcorn, too. Popcorn runs in our family. That's how he keeps baby happy while mommy's eating. Alright, that's it for today. I'm gonna sit down, edit this video, try to get some rest, and be ready for a new day tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching. Remember, have fun, be happy, dream it up, and live it out. See you next time.